Dave, go ahead. I got a question. So if you're buying or selling a house, like say, for example, you're selling a house and there's a there's a buyer's title policy because the bank, if he's, you know, if he's financing, the bank is going to require him to prove that, you know, what, what right. he's getting the money for doesn't have any liens. Why is it that the, that the seller also has to get the exact same title search done? Like, is that they're basically the same thing, right. um, usually done by the same company. Why right. is so it that Dave, they both have to do it? There's only one title search, but there are two title policies. There is an owner's policy where you, as a seller, are going to ensure the buyer that the buyer has good title to that piece of property. And there's a mortgagee policy that the buyer will pay for where he is ensuring that the lender has a good good, valid mortgage lien against the property. There are no laws that say that the seller has to pay for the owner's policy and the buyer has to pay for the mortgagee policy, but that is customary, Dave, and I hope that that answers your question for you. Let's so go. The, um, go ahead. So, the, so, the, so if the owner, or if the, I'm sorry, if the buyer is buying one and the owner is getting one, essentially the title company is charging twice for the same search and just putting a different title on the page? There's only one search fee, but there are two different fees for title policies. One's for an owner's policy, one's for a mortgagee policy, Dave. So I think, again, only one search, Dave. 